Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. My name is Theresa. In today's video, um, I'm missing one um, because <clears throat> I've never heard of a uh, laser ship before. And I had ordered some stuff from Joe Malone. It originally was supposed to be here on Friday. Didn't show up. Then I got a, um, a, a thing saying that it was intercepted for whatever reason. I'm like, whatever. Then they don't deliver on Saturdays and Sundays. Whatever. Yesterday morning, now I live here on the East Coast, and we were supposed to get up to 16 inches of snow. But I thank God. <laughs> Let me say that one more time. I thank God that... Um, we only got eight inches because you know 16 inches is just entirely too much darn tooting snow but i figured that they wasn't going to come yesterday because of the snow well something told me you know check my email i checked my email and it says it was delivered so i go to the front door now this is probably like 9 30 in the morning i go to the front door nothing's there no footprints because you can see you know um from the snow i go to the back door nothing's there so I'm sitting there and I'm like, okay, why would they say something is shipped? And then I'm like, did somebody walk up on my porch and steal? You know what I mean? And I'm, I'm getting a little heated. So I called Joe, um, Joe Malone's customer service and told him what was going on. And she was like, well, you know, we have to wait for five days because we've seen stuff get delivered. Yada, 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 yada. I'm like, okay, whatever. Something said for me to call laser ship. I call laser ship, dude is hemming and hawing, hemming and hawing, and I'm getting irritated, you know. There's, there's one thing I don't like, but there's several things, but this, this thing here will really make me just come unglued if you lie. Just come on out, tell me the truth. Don't lie about it. Dude says, oh, um, well, it says here that it was shipped, and I say, I know what it says, but I'm telling you, it's, it's not here. I said, we got snow. I would have seen somebody walk up to the back door because the footprints would have been in the snow. I would have seen that somebody walked up to the front door because of the snow. And then he's like, oh, well, let, let me research this. He comes back and says, oh, no, it wasn't delivered. I said, well, why did he say that it was delivered? You know, he said, oh, something was wrong with his scanner. Um, and that was the only button he was able to push. So at this point now, I'm going to lean back. I'm leaning back. <clears throat> There's a lie being told somewhere. So I said, okay, um, so when are they coming? I said, because I understand, you know, with today, you know, we're getting all this snow. So I understand them not coming today. And then he comes back and says, oh, well, the reason why the package wasn't delivered is because it was damaged. So what I feel like what took place, one, it was snowing. Two... They know that they can damage out stuff, and I don't know if it says on the box that it's coming from Joe Malone, you know, because this is my first time ordering from them. So, I said, well, I need something, um, I need an email saying that this is what took place so that I can get in contact with um, Joe Malone again and let them know what's going on. I said, because I don't want to call this company and not have confirmation of um something you know you're telling me that's going on and in all reality i know damn well that's not what happened i said because on friday this box was supposed to be delivered and it said it was intercepted okay i said the box wasn't damaged on friday y'all don't deliver on saturday and sunday so now all of a sudden today the box is damaged they were full of crap but bottom line um joe malone ended up you know, I told him what was going on, and I said, I don't want to deal with laser ship no more. So, um, now my stuff is coming through UPS. Okay. So, bond number nine, Liberty Island, New York. This is my first um, bond number nine. And... I am very happy um, because I actually have a decant of this here because I'm not one for, you know, doing a bunch of blind buys. This is what the bottle looks like. So this here is like more like a first impression type um, video. 
Mm, it just smells so delicious. And um, I'm looking at to buy um, what is it called? Golden Coast, Gold Coast, something like that. I'm looking to buy that. So this here came last week sometime, and I was gonna do um, everything all in one shot. But seeing as how the Joe Malone stuff didn't show up, and I'm like, whatever. So this here is a fruity, uh, floral fruit, fruity gourmand. It says top note is mandarin, orange, black currant, and bergamot. Middle notes are orange blossom and jasmine. Base notes is marshmallow and musk. And this is a 3.3 um, out fluid ounce. And like I said, I knew I liked the scent because I got it in in a decant. So I knew I liked it. And I will use this up before I start spraying and using that one. I only did that just to show y'all, you know, the sprayer thing. Then I have, uh, what is this, um, Terenzi, Tessiana Terenzi. And this one here is Draco. I love the top. And this here is a three point three point six. So it was a hundred mils. This is another beautiful scent. These tops is heavy as heck. You be don't beat the hell out of somebody with it. <laughs> oh my goodness so nice sprayer and this is also another beautiful scent um so the top note on this one here this is Draco is bergamot lemon orange and green notes this is oriental middle notes are peach magnolia jasmine cedar and patchouli base notes is musk pear vanilla tonka bean and what is this heliotrope heliotrope so again i'm very happy with my purchase um, there's one, well, there's a couple more that I do want to get, but I'm going to slow my roll. Now, what I did was this, I got a tester. And with that tester, instead of paying the $300 for this, and at the bottom, you can see that this is real because their name is right there. Let me see it right there. So, I know that the Andromeda one, you know, had the, the big old box and all of that. And I'm like, whatever. <laughs> and then this one here also came inside. This is another tester and this is Deluxe. And this is what this one here looks like. Top is different. And at the bottom, there it is. Tenziana Terenzi. And this one here smells fabulous. And Deluxe, Deluxe, excuse me. This one here is a floral woody musk. 
This is a unisex um, one. This here says that the top is coffee, uh, white, white hyacinths, and iris. The middle note is Turkish rose, vanilla. What is this? Oproxix, oprox, oproxnax. I know I just butchered that. <laughs> Base note is honey, amber, white musk, and cedar. This is also a hundred mil. So like I said, um, I'm very happy with my purchases. I will, um, like I said, this, this is the first impression. And then I got another sample um, from Scent, uh, yeah, Scent Angel. And I got a bigger um, Nishane. Floran, Floran, yeah, Floran. This is a 9 mil. This is also another beautiful scent. I had gotten a sample of this, and instead of getting a bigger bottle, mm, my God, my God. I decided to just get um, a 9 mil and then just use that. So this one here, top note, this is supposed to be a floral woody. So top note is grapefruit and cassius. Middle note, violet, lily of the valley, jasmine, and amber. Base note is vanilla, high cano, high can, let's see, high Hinoki and musk so I figured that you know I would use this here and then if not if but when I decide I'll go ahead and get a bigger bottle of this one here I wanted to try side effect by Anishio This one here is a nice one. Um, all that smokiness, I really don't need. I, I, I really don't. You know, it, it's nice. But I wouldn't buy a big bottle. And then I got a bigger bottle of this one here. Molecule 01. This here has a beautiful scent. To me, it, it plays like... Um, what is that? Um... Baca Rouge um, 540. It hides and then it comes back. But on me, when I was reading the the, um, the reviews, a lot of people said they couldn't smell it and then it was like um, a real woody, woody scent on them. To me, this is a must scent on, on me. So I guess everybody's body chemistry is different. And then by me buying um, which one was it? The Draco this here came in there and this here is this scent I tried it I like it and that will conclude <laughs> today's video um, when my stuff from Joe Malone comes I'll come back make another video about it and I'm going to play with these for you know another week or so and then I can come back and give you my real few uh, review you know of how I really really like it all right everyone my name is Theresa oh and today's lips is urban decay I don't know the color but it's urban decay um my name is Theresa please like share and subscribe and I will see each and every one of you in my next upload deuces